All right, this I think is my the fourth uh, antique reproduction steam engine that I've built. First time I've had it on steam. And I'm just running off one of my 20 inch boilers. And they're well matched because that boiler will keep up with the steam that it uses. So I'll turn on the valve here. Let's see how it goes. See that engine is brand new. First time I've run it today. And I just got a little exhaust pipe going out there. That exhaust pipe should go up the stack of the of the boiler though to get better draft. And this little oiler I found on eBay that goes with it. It's got oilers on the sides here now. That's new. And release valves at the top. Hot. Uh, about a 10 inch flywheel. And then I left, I left uh, room over on this side with the crankshaft to uh, put a big flywheel on, uh, like for uh, a V belt. And then you can run a generator with it. Generate electricity. So it's got forward and reverse. And it's, it's, it'll run it with 40 pounds of pressure right now, but it's up at 80. You don't need to to uh, stop it to go from forward to reverse either. I just it's hard to do with one hand here. underneath it kind of starts bouncing up and down so it's not the best for it. Of course it doesn't go with it, the working part doesn't go with it and the hose don't go with it either. It's the steam hose, it's just the oiler and everything else. Nice engine. As soon as it's broken in it will run a lot smoother. And this unit here has got an engine on it. It's a different style of engine. So this is not all part of the auction. It's just the engine over here. And that's about it.